Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna improve my logo, see if I can get a better logo out of this. So first, load image. I'm gonna get a blip caption. I'm gonna get the text from this to this and uh, show text by Python. And this will give me the text. This will describe my logo. Uh, let's see if there's any tags because I did generate this with AI. So WD14 tagger. Gonna go there. Key prompt. So we've got solo one by full body male underscore focus gray background gradient gradient background muscular glowing uh, ABS glowing eyes. Uh, these were not the tags I used, but it works. So we've got two. One's a description and one's the tags. So we're going to get these into one. A string, string function. Yes. Okay. So we're going to add uh, A to input and B to input. So we've got that as the description. Then you've got the tags. String. You can get give that to clip text and encode and add uh, change that to convert text to input add that to there we're going to need a clip check point loader simple we're going to clip that to that we're going to need a negative so i'm going to add another clip text encode Join that, change the text to your widget. And we've got conditioning. I'm going to add a case sampler, case sampler, conditioning positive, negative, uh, empty latent image. I'm going to add, add that to this. We're going to need the model to this. We're going to need a VAE decode over here. I'm gonna add the VAE from here to here and um, save image. I like save image because sometimes preview image. But sometimes you, you generate something and then you realize, hang on a sec, I did not save it. How do I get it back? You can always go to the temp folder and get it back before you close everything down. But this way you just make sure it works okay so time to tell let's do this gonna use all these details to generate a new image and that might be the wrong okay no we want to use a different model let's try deliberate the model basically we don't want to type anything in that's not doing much okay so solo one by one full body i know i, I did generate an image earlier if i, I can show you load image this one, but I'm not gonna use that. To do that, I need to use a seed, a specific seed, and it should generate that same one or similar. It did not because I'm using a different model. E. Okay, I forgot which model I used. Uh, maybe that. But I've got the tags there on that one anyway, so. Realistic. Yeah, let's try dash dark sushi. This is anime style. I like this one. Uh, I've got a feeling I'm going to change my logo to. Hang on a sec. I like that one too. So we'll randomize, generate again, and you can get a new logo from the description of your existing image. 
Now, say for example, we want to change this to. I uh, should I have Daniel Craig here somewhere. There you go, Daniel Craig. And what's the tags for this? A man in a red. No, oh, no let's run this. A man in uniform looking at the camera with a city in the background, London, England, UK. You got all that from that image, and that image has got no tags. It's a download from the internet with the clean. And this is the dark sushi mix. It's um, oh, it's, it's even got London skyline at the back. Okay, but let's change that to realistic. Uh, where where is it? Where is it? No, let's change it to juggernaut. Juggernaut Excel version seven. Let's try that one. This one might not work. I don't think that's the right kind of uniform. Let's try a different one, a realistic vision. Um, or, I know, I have realism engine. Let's try that one. Get rid of this. We're using Daniel Craig as. That looks better. Change that to 30, get a bit more detail. That looks a bit more like what we want. A bit young. So what we can do is uh, see what, cut, what the difference is between the generated and uh, existing. So we want string function uh, and blip let's get the blip here no we don't need the string functions right my bad get these two these three control c click here control v the image goes to here and that's already connected uh, image goes to here let's run this one more time and we should see blip we don't need we should see uh the difference between the two A man in uniform looking at the camera with a city in the background, London, England, UK. A young boy in a police uniform with a city in the background and a police badge on his shirt. That's a bit different. That's the description of this image itself. That's what we wanted. And the tags. Uh, solo looking at VR, short hair, blonde hair, shirt, one boy, clothes, mouth, jacket, upper body, etc, etc. Uh, it's pretty similar. And this one says one girl. Why one girl? Try it one more time. So this is handy, this workflow. If you've got an image that you like and you want similar images, use this workflow. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. I'm going to attach the workflow to the description and see you next time.